health can be a confusing thing. So many different diets, so many different methods of training, so many supplements, so many people saying do this, do that, do that, do that, do this thing, do that thing, do this protocol, do that protocol. It can be so confusing. So confusing. You get to a point where you think, I really, I really need to do something about my waistline, about my man boobs, about just feeling rubbish every single day, about waking up in the morning and not actually being awake. Three hours later when you're having to have that fourth cup of coffee, extra strong coffee, it can be overwhelming to think that it may be hard. No, it's going to be hard to change anything that's worth changing. And that's scary. It's scary to think that you've probably tried this, you've probably tried that. You've tried different methods, you've tried different supplements, and, and it's failed. It's scary. It's scary to think that you may fail again. It can be overwhelming. It can be so overwhelming when you've got the fitness industry, so many fitness professionals posting on Instagram of their perfect abdominal muscles, their perfect biceps and triceps, their perfect chest and eating ice cream every single day. It's scary because they're lying to you. There's no honesty there. It's scary because you're wondering why you're putting on weight when you're not even eating anything. It's scary because you don't want to and you haven't got the time to get to the gym five, six days a week. You haven't got the time to plan all your meals five, six, seven days a week. You haven't got a time to weigh every single gram of food you put into your mouth. It is scary. And it's scary because what if the wife sees that you've failed again? You've wasted the money again. Money that you could have spent on her. Money that you could have spent on going out for a nice day. Money that you could have spent on the kids, on yourself. But aren't you spending it on yourself? It's scary because of all that, all the things you have to give up, those luxuries you say you love, and then you see these fitness professionals that are lying to you, lying to you about what it actually takes, overwhelming you because you don't even want, you don't even want to look shredded. Looking pretty decent, looking decent in a shirt when you're rocking the mic on stage at that next mastermind. When you're recording your next online course. When you're simply around the table with your team and someone comments. You look really good. You look like you've been lifting. Or like my client John when he was on the stage and then he got right up in the international press. To say... This guy looks like he's got some time for the gym. How successful he is. That comment stood out. All the work he'd been putting in. All the effort to get his food as close to as perfect as possible. Perfect is different for every single person. Perfect is dependent on where you are at right now. Perfect for me won't be perfect for you. What works for me won't work for you. Just because someone intermittent fasts, doesn't mean it's going to work for you. Just because someone goes keto, doesn't mean it's going to work for you. And getting healthy is scary. It is scary because it's confusing. And honestly, if I were you, I'd want to just stay in the same position as I am now. I get it. I 100% get it. If you don't want it to be scary, if you don't want it to be confusing, if you don't want to get overwhelmed... Drop me a message and let's have a chat. Simple chat, a one day body upgrade call. No sales, let me see where I can help you. Drop me a message and we'll get it booked in. I look forward to speaking to you.